È bello amare il calcio. Lega Serie A e Team presentano la Serie A Team. League leaders Inter's next opponent is a 2006 World Cup winner with Italy, who is back in the limelight. Massimo Oddo, a star on the pitch until 2012. Then a new adventure in the dugout. First as coach of his hometown club Pescara, now in the northeast of Italy, in Udine. I accepted the job at Udinese because it's a very professional club with a great history and a good team that has the potential to have an excellent season. But above all, because you simply can't say no to a job in Serie A. What struck me most when I arrived was the organization of the club. Even though I've played for some big clubs, I've not seen many with the kind of facilities found here. My target is to improve the team, do well, collect as many points as possible and give the team belief, because when you have belief, things become a lot easier. The players have responded well to my arrival and what I've asked of them. I don't know how far we can go. Right now we haven't settled on an objective. I don't like making promises because the only ones I can make are those I can keep. It helps that I have been in the same dressing room as some big stars, but also being at smaller clubs can help because you gain experience from all of them, which you remember when you become a coach. As a coach, I always try to be myself, just like I did as a player and away from the pitch with my friends. It's my character. It's important to respect everyone's roles, but I also enjoy having a laugh with the players, as if I were still one of them. Being a coach is about having a philosophy. I have never tried to base my coaching style on one coach, but I have tried to take something useful from the best I've played under, but also the worst, because you can learn from the mistakes that they made. In matches, I want my players to take the initiative, think for themselves, and ensure that they aren't tied down to preset routines. Maxi Lopez gets inside the box, looking for the shot, and it's 2-0! Udinese doubled the lead! A big hello to all the Udinese fans around the world. Bye for now.